Hello Leute, welcome to this new video. In this video I will show you how you can render Blender stuff for free. Um, and for that you have first to go on sheepit renderfarm.com and um, you have to make an account first and um, then you have to get to the tab get started and when you scroll down you can see in the bottom left there's an estimator uh, where you can calculate how many points uh, you will pay then above that you can choose your file it has to be in dot bland file um, and that you can just choose and then click on send this file uh, but in the dot bland file you have to make sure that um, in blender uh, you have to go on file and then um, go to uh, go to the external data and then automatically pack into blend uh, and then you have to save it again so all textures and stuff like that will pack into the data or you can just pack all uh, and if you don't want to save it again and um, if you click on save this file you will get to this uh, upload new project and uh, you can choose your blender version I will just leave it there you can generate an mp4 video but if you don't really have to do it leave it unchecked and um, you so you will uh, download every single um, every single image I will just check every compute method uh, GPUs don't support all things but I will just choose all that's a few things you can choose single frame if you just have an image or animation and there you can choose a start and end frame um, if you have have a too big image of frames uh, you will have to split it up um, in multiple uh, multiple tiles but uh, that also can happen if you um, if you uh, choose to uh, many samples but uh, you have to consider that uh, the uh, that the denoising will be disabled for the splitting you can also uh, see how much you should split it in the calculator in the estimator sorry you can also check advanced options if you check advanced options uh, um, then you can choose uh, how much memory it should take up and uh, and um, if you're done with all that uh, you can go to add this blend file so now you go to the administration uh, screen if you like you can also change the setting here like uh, compute method and uh, mp4 and the rendering technology And uh, on the top, you can see how uh, how much storage is used. And um, 
if you have an animation you can see every frame as a gray box and uh, don't worry about uh, that no uh, nothing is there you have to refresh it sometimes and actually the uh, the most time consuming part is the waiting and um, the rendering itself is not that uh, hard so um, and here I will go to my account and here you can see how many uh, how many points I have and the points or credits um, you don't actually need them but uh, uh, if you have more then you get a higher priority and you, your project will uh, be rendered faster um, and if you have less points then you have to wait a little bit longer but rendering itself is not uh, that affected by it so um, here you can see in the tab uh, in the tab projects you can see uh, everything that's uh, currently rendering and here you can see that currently there are in my project five rendering and two finish so if I go back now it's already uh, it's already five finished and uh, multiple in progress and on the bottom you can see every person who's rendering and you can also see now that in summary there are um, more points like point spent and um, the time that it's rendering currently. You can also go to the statistics about the render and see more details about the render. When you're done, don't worry this is a different click on download frame between the frames and then you have them just in your download folder.